Hello everyone, welcome to a, another video on Framer. Today in this video I will show you how to add Namecheap domain to Framer. Also this can be applied to GoDaddy as well, to any uh, hosting out there. It's very very simple. So let's get started for more videos. You can check our channel uh, for more Frame videos or Framer videos. So let's get started. So basically we have a landing page right here and we want to connect this landing page to our uh, you know, Namecheap domain. What we can do is we can go to settings, we can go to domains, and from here we can click connect a domain your own. Uh, now, uh, this is a way where you can upgrade, uh, so you will need to upgrade in order to connect a Namecheap domain to your Framer um, platform, so you can either upgrade or uh, you can go and use a free domain. So that's that's two options you have now. Uh, if you want to connect a custom domain to your um, you know to your website, you can go also to publish, add a custom domain, and as you can see, you can also add a free custom domain or a third-party domain. Now, um, obviously, if you want to go and add a domain from, uh, for example, Namecheap, Namecheap, you need to add a records and a C name. So. A records and C name will be displayed right here. You will just need to add them to your uh, Namecheap uh, domain. Now, uh, obviously, if you go to Namecheap, let me go to Namecheap here. If you go to Namecheap and if you go to account dashboard, let me just log in real quickly here. Uh, I will show you in a second, uh, you know, what I mean by this. So, yeah. Now, as you can see, I'm here in Namecheap. So as I said, when you're in Framer here, when you connect a custom domain, you will need to put your uh, A name and C name. So where can you find those A name and C name and where can you change it in Namecheap? You on Namecheap, you need to go here and you need to basically go and manage on the domain. Now, once you click manage on the domain here, you will need to basically go and uh, yeah, you will need to go to advanced DNS or here you will be able to go and add your name cheap or a C name and a name basically. So you want to add a C name and a name from your uh, framer and that will be basically it. Once you add that uh, on name cheap, just go here, click confirm and you will be ready to go. So this is basically how you can add name cheap domain to framer. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video.